Yo, what to do, YouTube? It is your boy Coast Talk back with another video. I know it's been a while. Um, we haven't really missed much since the last video. Um, nothing really uh, cult wise was really important or going on at the sake. Maybe like controversy at quarterback, maybe like Phillip Rivers or Tom Brady, but we've been through that already. I pretty much told you guys that the Colts are going to stay with Jacoby Bissett probably, and it's looking like that as of now. But we're not here for that. Um, appreciate all you guys with the continuous support. I'm thanking all the all the subscribers that are still here. All the comments I get, I appreciate all the love. I really do. Um, this is currently on Anthony Costanzo. He decided to sign back with the Colts for a two-year deal. Um, the the veteran is back with the two-year deal, thirty-three million dollar contract. He is now the highest-paid left tackle. And in my opinion, Anthony Costanzo is one of those guys that you want on your line. You know, he is injury prone. I get that. But he is catching up with the age. He will be 32 coming up. But when he's healthy and he's on the field, he's one of the best offensive linemen you will want on your team. And him lined up with Quentin Nelson on that side of the field is dangerous. It's dangerous. We had one of the best offensive lines last year, if not the best, in my opinion. And I'm not being biased. I'm just stating facts. We had one of the best offensive lines last year. And Anthony Costanzo is a big part of that. Um, so we did sign him to a two-year deal. Uh, way back in January, uh, Ballard um, spoke on Costanzo. He said, we think a lot of Costanzo. Um, I do think he plays at a high level still. And I think he got three or more years of high-level play at left tackle left um all pro pff on the list uh he was a pro bowl alternative um anthony costanzo is loved in indy uh we love his play when he's on the field um his dedication and he's a team guy um and he's a good leader as well in the locker room so anthony costanzo uh welcome back to indy um next year should be a good year for us we got a lot coming up man we're still waiting on the draft Free agency just started. Um, I don't know if you guys heard, but Calais Campbell is now out of Jacksonville on his way to Baltimore. We do face him next year, I believe. So we're still going to see Calais eventually, but it won't be as often as we used to. Uh, but it's going to be a good year for us next year. I'm claiming it now. Uh, I'm kind of I'm stoked. Um, I'm happy we got Costanzo back. Keeping the offensive line together is always a major key in the NFL. Um, you know, you got to have a group of guys that build that chemistry. And just as long as you keep them together, um, it's, everything should work well. Um, we're still going to have Marlon Mack. Uh, the run game should work. So I'm excited to what, to what we're going to bring next year. Um, the free agency is still here. We still got the draft. So I would love to see what the boys are going to do in free agency and who we're going to draft in free agency as well. So it's probably going to be a lot of defense, in my opinion. But I'm stoked, man. I'm ready for the NFL, man. With this coronavirus going around and the NBA being out, we're running out of options here. So the only thing we can wait on is the NFL, right? I mean, the NFL is still here, which is good news. So Colts Nation, we're almost there. Uh, let's see if we can make a push in free agency. And if we do, you got to have another video coming. But I do have another video dropping in a few hours. Um, so stay tuned for that. Go ahead and comment if you like the signing of Anthony Costonzo. And who do you think we should get in free agency? I will definitely be in the comment section looking for those. Until next time, Coast Nation, Coast Talk signing out. Follow me on Twitter. Peace.